Here is my vertical twin cylinder engine that I just completed. It's running at a much more sedate pace now. It's running on about 10 PSI there at the moment. It idles down nice and slow with that little wee two inch flywheel on it. I can't get over that. Um, I am running Viton rings on the pistons. In yesterday's videos I said I was running them on the cylinders. Um, this is not my best work. I don't really have any good way of holding those 1 8 control rods while I thread them. So I ordered a new smaller chuck yesterday that I can hold them so they won't turn when I go to thread them. The trouble is with those things, if you thread them freehand, it's almost impossible to keep the damn die going straight. And then you get some strange oinky angles on the things that attach to the end of the guide rods. I've taken this off the top of the wooden bench and just set them on a piece of cloth. I find that that wooden bench acts like an echo chamber and it makes a terrible racket when it's sitting right straight on the wood. We'll turn it around a little bit here so you can see the other side. There we are from the other side. I do plan on putting an exhaust manifold on it. Right now I've just got it running with the two holes out through the sides of the cylinders. Uh, I will put an intake manifold and an exhaust manifold on it. And if you zoom in, you can see I've got some really strange looking keepers on my 1.8 pins. That's just a temporary setup, and that particular pin wanted to keep sliding out, so I loctited a, a small piece of brass that I had cut for something else on it. But this, this, I'm quite happy with this. I'm going to uh, work on the Stevenson's reversing link. This does self-start, this engine. It self-starts quite well. It has to have a little more pressure running to it than you see currently, uh, or it just doesn't have enough beans to get it going. But if I turn the pressure up 5 pounds, I can shut it off, and as soon as I turn the air back on, it'll start by itself without any issues. And this is the last video I'll post of it until I make some other greater changes to it. Thanks for having a look.